All right, boys and girls and everything else. Today, the plan is simple. I'm tired. It's almost 10 o'clock. And, uh... I've made a commitment I should not have made. And now I have to continue Sonic Adventure 2, so this is going to be wonderful. A uh, good observation, Knuckles. I couldn't tell by the massive angry pumpkin. So you see, the thing about Pumpkin Hill is it has really good music, but the level itself really sucks. Mostly because it's a level in a Sonic Adventure title where you aren't playing as Sonic Adventure himself. It's a floor and also a ceiling. Thanks for that wonderful hint. I think that applies to most things. Oh, that's Church Mountain. The mountain with the church on it. This doesn't fucking help me. Endless journey, that's what this level feels like. I found him. I found him. I come to make an announcement. Shadow the Hedgehog's a bitch ass motherfucker. He pissed on my fucking wife. That's right. He took his hedgehog huh. and quilly dick out and he pissed on my fucking wife and he said his dick was this big. Man, this cutscene's just how I remembered it. Man, he pissed on that thing way too hard! He just it really had a lot of pent-up hatred for Barack Obama tales, it's pretty simple. Oh, if you thought I disliked Pumpkin Hill, you haven't seen anything yet. This level takes Pumpkin Hill and makes it look fantastic. And, I mean, Pumpkin Hill's not fantastic. So that's saying something about this one. I already hate Tails gameplay. So imagine just like a normal Tails level, but like 40 times worse, and that's what this is. Why is Tails wanted for a million Sonic bucks? I think I said in the first video for Sonic Adventure 2 that I feel like these games had like a really strong basis for like Sonic and Shadow gameplay. And that I wish they had expanded on it. Uh, and only recently I realized they actually did expand on it with um, Sonic Heroes and Shadow the Hedgehog. Uh, and Sonic 06 to an extent. And uh, yeah, essentially what I'm saying is uh, my statement was stupid because when they expanded on it, it just made it clear how like flawed it really is because Sonic Heroes and Shadow the Hedgehog are not good. But hey, at least those games didn't have mech stages. No, I'm not dying here. I have died right here so many different times, it is annoying as hell. Whatever. No, you didn't. Oh, but just when you thought they'd let you have fun again, they throw you right back into Knuckles levels. You sure did. Oh boy, Route 101! Because they still can't give you a Sonic level, that would be too much fun. I found Obama. Mission complete, Sonic. Obama has been found. Hi, Obama. I found Obama! Fuck yeah! Mr. President, reports show that since the incident three hours ago, the country is in turmoil. Our financial communities are impacted, and our satellite communications are down. An emergency meeting has been called. Mr. President, this is a national crisis. Um, yes. Uh, what am I meant to do about an international crisis? I am, uh, no longer president. I have not been for, uh, four years now. Why am I white? How the fuck did we get to Egypt? I don't know. Is that a big triangle or something? I don't care what it is, I'm gonna punch it. Cause that's what I do. And what are you gonna do, pink? Hey, don't be so mean to Amy, she's literally just standing there. Imperial's not a word! Oh, but then you thought the Tails levels couldn't get worse than Mission Street, and you were wrong again! 
This level's awful. This is like the worst mech level in either of the Sonic Adventure games. This is such a god-awful excuse for a level in a video game. This should not exist. I don't understand how Sonic Team thought this was a good idea, or honestly that Tails in a mech was a good idea at all. I don't think it would have been the end of the world if Tails was not playable in this game, or if Dr. Eggman was not playable in this game. Now granted, Dr. Eggman is the best character in the Sonic the Hedgehog series, um, I would still be fine with not being able to play as him in this game. Oh yeah, here's why this level sucks. Fucking quicksand. My issue with Sonic Adventure 2 is that I love the Sonic and Shadow levels, but there's like... 18 of them total combined in this game between Sonic and Shadow. No, not 18, like 10. No, there are 10. And the other 20 you're playing is Tails and Knuckles. The Knuckles I can tolerate. But that is one third of the game where you are playing as Tails and Dr. Eggman. And that's just unacceptable. I might expect that the next Sonic game I play for this channel is gonna be, like, Maybe Sonic Heroes, Shadow the Hedgehog, um, and you'd think wrong because I don't want to continue torturing myself. Those games aren't as bad as this game uh, because you don't have to play as Tails all the time, but they're still bad because the level design is not fit around how slippery Sonic the Hedgehog, Shadow the Hedgehog, Espio the Thing, I think he's a chameleon, and uh, Amy Rose are, so... Yeah, I'm not even gonna bother. If I ever play a Sonic game for this channel again after this, it's probably gonna be Sonic Forces, because that's a Sonic game that I not only like, but, uh, think has a lot of really good opportunities to make jokes on. Oh my god, finally! You're lucky you did, Tails. I wanna do at least one Sonic level. And that's what this is. Unfortunately, this is the worst Sonic level in the game. But we're getting close to what is, like, the second best Sonic level in the game. I don't know what that was all about. I should have been doing, like, jumps and cool stuff. You know, stuff you can do while you play as Sonic the Hedgehog. So the reason I say this is a bad Sonic level is because it is not geared around going fast. It is geared around going slow and solving puzzles that are not even puzzles. Is meant to waste your time. You know, like a Sonic game. Meant to waste your time. Except that's the opposite of what Sonic games are meant to do, if I recall correctly. Maybe I'm going crazy. I don't know. But this level does have a really strong opening, so I shouldn't be complaining yet. I mean, this just looks cool. I swear it looks cooler when the game isn't lagging immensely. Yeah, this is this I this is this level's idea of puzzles. You pick up the thing, you move it like four steps, you overshoot it because the game lags, place it down on the thing, and that's it. That's the puzzle. It doesn't get more advanced than that. Good puzzle game designers. Fuck that enemy placement. Oh my god, I feel like I'm saying the F word way too much. Adventure 1. <laughs> well, did you look at that? It's the end of a level. Never thought it would come. Sonic Adventure 2 is the pinnacle of fast-paced gaming. Yes, no!